Um, this is a image I used the other day uh, from Laureline Sturzer. Uh, I love this picture. And yesterday I showed you how to do a couple things. And I noticed on it, if we zoom in here, see the background? It's, a, it's glass and it has some water spots on it. I thought I'd show you how to get rid of those in this two minute tutorial. Since the rest of the picture is fine, we don't need to do anything. So just grab your lasso tool and draw an approximate around the area where you're seeing the dust. It's not dust on this particular case, but it's smudges on the glass. So you can see I'm just drawing that area out. It does not have to be exact. There it is drawn. Next thing I'm gonna do is feather it. There's my feather selection. And again, this only way you learn about how much the feather is according to the file size. Um, my experience is on the file size this big, we should probably go for about a 34. By the way, the file size you can find it right here under image size. See, this file is a 40 meg file. So my made a nice little soft edge. I'm going to hide that marching ants, go up to filter, down to noise, and across the dust and scratches. Click it and you've got your controls right here. And I like to put it close because you can see that it works. You can see what's happening on the screen while you're looking at your um, dialog box. So pick the minimum amount to where the scratches and dust go away. That one doesn't bother me too much right there. Everything else, you don't wanna to go too far on this. If you go too far, you'll see that it gets a little too fuzzed out. See how bad that is? So, just pick the minimum amount. In this case, it's about 21. Threshold means the maximum is zero. Say okay, and we'll zoom in here, and you can see there's with the spots, and there it is that quick, they're out. And that's our two minute tutorial for today. Mike Agriola for Student Stock. <laughs> On camera, multiple levels. <laughs> Now you know what you have to be like to work at Student Stock. <laughs> See you soon.